Hello and welcome everyone, my name is Bebby and today we're going to play some more Super Dungeon Run. And I went ahead and, and, and got some upgrades myself. Let's take a mission, we're going to get the bootleg booze, we already have that by the way. We've got some more side quests, uh, that is fine. We've got skill points to, to uh, spend actually. Let's get some more hero training, there we go, we've got two. And almost maxed that out. Let's enter the dungeon and see how this goes. There we go, we've got the treasure chest right off the bat, we've got two potions. We have a strength potion, that is actually new. Uh, I did purchase that, and I must say, they can be really, really handy. <laughs> they, they come in really handy at times. Got to use them with uh, caution though. I don't know what that, that, those barrels were all about, but that seemed like something that would contain a lot of rubies and stuff like that. A lot of resources. Hmm... Let me let me take a quick sip of my tea right there. And let's open these chests. So there we go. We've got two upgrades. A mage and a hunter. That's nice. We've got the boost. Uh, attack boost uh, activated because we... Oh. Let's not leave you behind, lad. <laughs> we don't want that. We're one happy family after all. And let's smash up these guys and that guy. And that open the bad magical door which we already... I guess we didn't have access to. Step on the pressure plate. Don't get shot by the uh, cannon. That's generally not a good thing to do. There we go. We could open that door, but nah. I don't really feel like it. Let's just beat up these goblins and uh, get to the exit of the dungeon. That's the ultimate goal, though. After all, I mean... Pfft. Choosing wrong words, meh. It doesn't sound good. There we go. That's another floor uh, completed. Seven kills, four out of 13 gold, bad. But time is fast, so we do gain a ruby. And we actually need those, or is it the wood? I think it's actually the wood that we need. And um, we're gonna have to collect those, actually. Maybe smashing up some barrows isn't a bad thing. There we go, that is the first wood already. And that would upgrade the overall damage of the hunters. And um, right now, we have a lot of them. You will have to, you'll see though, once we upgrade, we're not going to get any hunters anymore. That's uh, generally what happens. I think I have boosted damage for the uh, for the warriors. I actually use the, uh, the stamina potion there. Oh my god. That did quite the damage. Quite the damage. Should we use a potion? I don't think we need a potion of health. Let's get through that door. There we go. I've got some uh, nice little goblins to smash off. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. I do think you um you might be able to get a higher score or better goods if you smash up more goblins. So I guess we're going to have to focus on that a little bit. Let's open this up and see what kind of potion we get. We got a health potion. Maybe we should use it this although we have minimal damage. So overall it feels it feels not worth it. Maybe we should um use it for a more needy moment. Doesn't sound right. Let's get that guy right off the corner and that probably screwed up our time. Hmm. No, it did not. Um, we get two bars of steel. <laughs> we don't need those. Maybe in the future though. So all, all done to those. Thank you very much. And we got another upgrade. What, what, what are we going to get? We have Oh my god, we have two strength potions. That's really bad because we already have all our potion slots filled. Let's so hope we meet some goblins pretty fast, otherwise we won't be using those. No, there's no goblins in this level after all. And we've got one wood out of that. That is good. We need wood. Good wood. Ah, not gonna fall for that again. What? Nah! Bollocks. Alright. I'll take it like a man. I'll take it like a man. I hope we get an upgrade. We, we still have two peasants, and I would like to get rid of them. I would like to get better classes. 37 seconds. Hmm. Good enough. We got some cloth, though. Uh, not the wood. Not the wood. Alright, we got our health regained, and we got one more warrior. That's nice. Uh, gonna get rid of that last peasant, but we're gonna gain two peasants. That's nice. Oh, three actually. That's quite a lot. We didn't even need them! That was the floor already! That's silly as all hell. 
All right. Time fast. All right, I like that. I like that. There we go. Let's burst through this door and get through the dungeon. Uh, no, we can't burst through steel doors. I don't want to go there. Thank you very much. This is the same damn dungeon I died last time. Ah. Don't get too close to the fire. I'm not going to risk getting that chest. I'm not going to risk losing all my guys or gaining a, another soldier. That's just silly. That doesn't make any sense to me. All right, there we go. This should be the final room. Oh, this is actually where the booze is. Magical door opened. Good to know. Ah, there's probably not even goblins in this um, in this level. I don't want to leave you guys behind. Oh my god, go around the machine! You silly. <laughs> there we go. All right, we're going to smash up some more booze to open more doors. Got the fire right there. Let's wait until that ends. There we go. Smash through that door again, and smash up this right there. And there we go, that's two booze machines. Hmm, we got a skull right there. It, it looked like a little bit of cold. Not cold, gold. Ah, oh, it's actually not too hard to pass by, but it just um, consumes your time, I guess. There we go. So I guess risking, quote unquote, is not really a thing here. No! Don't stay behind hitting that up! Oh my god. My characters are too silly. There we go. And that should be the last one, actually, because I saw a room full of those uh, brewing stances. Or stands. And yes, it is. It is. Let's uh, smash those up. And there we go. Quest completed. Very nice. Let's see what we get. Quite some experience and quite some wood as well. We actually need that. That is really nice. And we made level 9. Really nice upgrade for Minerva's Thread. Weaving in even a small amount of this magical thread helps protect sorceress from harm. I guess that is a good thing. These um, classes tend to be very fragile and uh, we're going to protect them of course. Let's see, sorceress. Uh, we do that over here. But I would prefer first upgrading the archer's ability, actually. Um, oh, they have two upgrades. Yeah, I want the serrated broadheads. There we go. And we can actually uh, afford that one as well. Can't afford the Minerva's Threat, though. We use those gems on the archers. But that is fine. Agility Potion. Archer drink of this mysterious elixir. The attack speed of all heroes will increase. That is good, but nah, not necessary, actually. Attack damage is probably more beneficial, so what we're going to do is we're going to do yet another dungeon run and uh, see how lucky we get. There we go. We got two upgrades right off the bat to warriors. That's uh, not too shabby. And we got a, a strength elixir, but we probably don't need that. We probably don't. Oh, that's the end of the dungeon already. All right. <laughs> Beats me. Let's see. Time fast. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah, it really was fast. Probably as fast as you can get. Alright, I see another upgrade chest and I see some potions. That's nice. We've got all our potion slots filled. And we now have a hunter, so those um, those upgrades weren't for nothing. That's uh, good to hear. Good to know. Do we want to smash up those pots? No, we don't. You silly archer. You're an ass. Don't... You're an ass. You're an ass. Should probably move towards the vases then and the pots. There we go. It feels like these are urns. That, that is really, really callous. Smashing up urns. That is not the way to do it. It's not, to, not the way to deal with stuff. Slow time, but we did gain an archer, that, so that's fine. There we go. Let's get these upgrades. And one and a two. There we go. Let's do upgrades. And we only have two peasants left. That's not too bad. Let's use a, a strength potion there. Oh, Jesus, I keep spitting. Yeah, you're going to be hit inevitably. Let's use a health potion there. 
Uh, get rid of those skellies and uh, get this chest open. Oh, there we go. We have the mage. It's uh, weird how a man transforms into a woman, but uh, let's neglect those technicalities. Uh, uh, obviously, that that can't be real. All right, let's smash that up. And I think we're actually nearly there. We're nearing at least the end. It seems. Oh, I didn't select a quest. Yeah, I forget that you have to reselect once you uh, finish a quest. How to keep that in mind? It's pretty bad. I don't know if, if you, when you do that, the run just uh, lasts forever. But I guess t only time will tell. All right, there we go. Let's get these chests. And these should boost our experience quite a bit. Keep spitting, probably because of the drinking and talking at the same time. It's not a good idea, generally. All right, let's ignore that uh, magician. Let's just get past. What is this? What is that? A red glow over some of our characters. Oh, you silly archer. This should stick to the herd. Let's uh, use a strength potion there. Oh my god, we actually wreck house here. No, no. Are you going to ruin our time? <sighs> oh my god. Alright, we've got 5 of the 15 out of 15 enemies killed. Time is still fast. Didn't screw up our time too badly. What is in that vase? Nothing. It did glow, but it, there was nothing in it. Let's get some, some experience and some more. There we go, level up. Probably good. The monsters are starting to get stronger, I noticed. There we go, there we go. We have enough health. We should, we should probably not use the uh, health potion. We've got another potion though, so maybe we want to do that. Our slots are full, so we're going to have to use those. There we go. Uh, I know this one. I know this one. Yes, the dungeons tend to get repetitive after a while. No. Yes. <laughs> we did evade the flames just by a bit though, but uh, I guess that's fine. One potion, two potions. There we go. We've got the potion slots filled up again. Although, we probably don't need them anymore. I don't know if this is the last one. Might be one more. This should be the last. Although, that depends on if you can actually finish a dungeon if you haven't selected a quest. I don't know. Maybe it lasts until you die. Hmm. Got two potions, and they are instantly activated because... Potions that's so full. Marvellous. We don't have any baddies right here. Should we collect all the gold? I don't think so. Let's just walk past. Gold is one of those things that's really easy to get by. Let's not get there. I do know that spikes tend to rise there and uh, generally kill you off. That's not nice. <laughs> Let's enjoy my tea there. Yes. There we go, we've got three potion chests, and they are all activated really bad. We didn't have any damage, and we didn't need two potions. Uh, one was enough. Strength potions, that is. I don't even think there's any enemies in this run. This is exactly the same dungeon! Oh, it's 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 a bit different. All right. Let's not bash the game too quickly. Let's use a strength potion. I like how the enemies blast away, it's just golden. You need one hit, and they're, they're dead. Someone killed there. Let's use that again, actually. No, open the chest. You silly. You walked right past it. Why didn't you open it? Do we have to find another route? Do we actually have to go here? Oh, that is terrible. Oh my god. Most of them died, though, because of the spikes. Oh, we don't have any potions anymore. We'll have to change that. Don't walk into the spikes. Don't do that. Thank you very much. Did we? No, we didn't use that potion. 
Alright, the spikes are up. Can you be damaged by uh, spikes that are raised already? Don't know. They don't care to find out either. No, that's the beginning of the dungeon. There should be an exit. Are you going to tell me <laughs> that there's no exit? That would be pretty weird. Let's see. Hmm. Oh, we left a guy behind. And <laughs> now we do leave another one behind. Let's get you back. And there you go. Oh! Wow, what was that? Some kind of ogre guy. That was probably the last level, though. I don't know. Alright, there we go. That's the exit. I hope, at least. I hope we get back to town. Maybe we just keep progressing until we die. Who knows? We did kill all, en all enemies and collected nearly all gold stacks. You know what? I'm just going to commit suicide. <laughs> Seems like the most sensible option here. And we got some nice potions there. All right, cheers, man. And we've got two villagers. Let's move through. Are there any nice upgrades here? I don't know. Let's use that power potion. Uh, enter that room. There we go. Use it a little bit on these other uh, characters as well. And we've got some more characters. Oh my god, we got a swarm going on here. An absolute swarm. That's really nice. Alright, let's see. Should be the exit. Yes. Wow, we, we have we have a swarm going on. I may want to continue this. We got a fast timing wood and cloth. That's nice. Finish off the last bit of my tea. Two upgrades. Oh, that's beneficial. <laughs> we got the um, strength potion activated, though. That's um, kind of a waste, I feel. Oh, that's not the door that opens. Makes sense. Generally, doesn't happen that the door you face is going to open if you pr uh, step in the pressure plate. Actually, I have to enter uh, another room most of the time. Let's use a potion of health. I don't think there's any critical uh, health uh, bars here. So we probably don't need to use those. And that room is not opened. How weird. Hmm. Ah, we've got one of those ogre guys again. Let's beat him up. There we go. Or maybe get beat, beat up. No, no, no. We didn't make it. Right, there's another room here. Let's just beat up all characters. It does feel very satisfying to beat them up. I must say it. Absolutely true with the swarm like this. And a potion, not too shabby. Probably need that after fighting that ogre. Uh, Skelly, not too bad. Not too bad. Where's the pressure plate for that room with the magician? The dungeons are starting to get more elaborate, so that's good to see. Good to see. So, my guess is that they tend to re be repetitive at the beginning of the game. Because obviously you're going to be in the same dungeons after, uh, well, time and time again. Curious. I started to find out more and more about the game. Oh, we did leave someone behind. That's not good. Gotta to stay together, man. Come here. All right. No, that is not a way to go. Down here. No, we'll smash through this door. Ah, no strength potions. Let's use a health potion because we are critical health for most of our characters, at least. There we go. A magical door open. Probably have to move all the way around. <laughs> there we go. When did we step on a pressure plate, though? Hmm. Can't really recall that. Uh, I'm gonna be honest, but that's fine. No, he's dead. Oh, there's all the pl pressure plate. That seems very dangerous. Let's get that chest. Get the hell out of that room. Use a potion. And we lost a guy. Oh, don't stand there! Ah! Alright, I, I, I got him back, but in the process of doing so, I lost another man. That's sad. That's sad indeed. Alright, we've got a ruby, some gold, and experience. Not too not too shabby. Let's uh, find the end of the dungeon. If there is any. Or if there are any. 
Can't use proper grammar, man. That's one of the rules here. Want to smash up some um, Varsus? Sure. <laughs> Let's use that strength potion and uh, smash these guys around. Oh, I actually didn't use that. That's weird. I did press 1. Uh, we're nearing the exits. They tend to get wrong now. Oh, the damage doesn't count on the Varsus. We still have to hit twice. That's weird. Oh no! Oh no! As one of those orcs. Oh no! We're not gonna. We're not gonna make it properly. Use that potion, whatever it's gonna be. Kill that guy. Open up a door. There we go. Have another potion. Maybe that's going to save our life. I don't know. I don't think we can take on that ogre, though. But we're going to have to run past. All right, let's just try to do so. Ah. We can shoot him from a distance. Look at that. What a silly guy. <laughs> He's not doing anything. Oh, that is ridiculous. Alright, there we go. That is a room cleared. Uh, I, uh, I guess killing those orcs is not too bad. Too loud. Oh my god. Alright, cheers, man. Cheers, man. Alright, that'll be it for today. Uh, I'll see you guys another time. Let's just exit to... Let's just commit suicide, I guess. <laughs> By... I don't know getting hit by something, some fire or something. Because I, I don't feel like running endlessly through the dungeon here. Oh, that's, that's the floor already. Alright, fine. Fine by me. Let's hope we find some traps. Commit suicide and exit the dungeon. Oh my god, this seems like one that's not going to contain any monsters and hazardous uh, situations as well. Uh, and the reason I want to go back to village is because if we don't do that by committing suicide, we're not going to get our rewards. And the dungeon is going to run forever. So, yeah, we want to do that. We want to do that. Let's open up the magical portal by killing these guys. And they're starting to get really, really strong, so they might actually be able to slaughter us. No, they're not. But, weird, nah. Let's run into the fire. There we go. <laughs> Alright, I'll see you guys later. Cheers.